Hello, hello. Welcome to Clock Tower 3. I'm uh, essentially playing this game blind. Technically, I played this game when it released 100 years ago on the PlayStation 2. I rented it when I was a kid and played it. I did not beat it. I don't remember anything about the playthrough. Uh, so other than remembering generally what type of game it is, uh, I'm basically playing totally blind. Should be a good time. And yeah, I haven't even watched like the opening cutscene or anything yet. So let's let's jump in and see what it's like. Oh, let me update uh, Twitch. I swapped games. There we are, updated Twitch. Now I do remember this game being kind of weird and very different from the previous three Clock Tower games. Pretty cool opening cutscene. That's a hype intro. I'm excited for this game. What do we got in options? Anything I care about? Doubt it. Search, duck, walk, attack, view map, special arrow, vibration and subtitles on, looks good. Uh, view. What? Uh, screen? What is this like? Oh, wow. Okay. I'm good there. Oh, did I change something? Get me out of here. Cool. All right. Well, let's just jump into it. New. Dearest Alyssa, how have you been? I think of you every day. It seems such a long time since you started your life at boarding school. It was after your beloved grandfather went missing while traveling three years ago that I sent you away to boarding school and told you not to come back for at least six years. Jeez. Without giving you any explanation. <laughs> it must have been very painful for you, and I'm sorry. Bye, honey. Don't come home for six years. Action. Now, your 15th birthday is approaching, and I fear your life may be in danger more than ever before. Please, go into hiding until your 15th birthday has passed. I know that what I am saying will make no sense to you, but please, do as I tell you and hide as quickly as you can. Your loving mother, Nancy. Mum. Alyssa, you're wanted on the telephone. I'm Is not here, mom? I'm just an illusion. Okay. Hello? I, I suspected Hello? that. Well, I'm very British in this game. Answer me. 
Look at them crispy PS2 visuals. What a graphical upgrade this game is compared to the last one. Mom, I'm back. This is next gen here. Excuse me. Uncle Fester? Are you one of the lodgers? Yes, I am. Oh, I'm Alyssa, Nancy's daughter. Um, do you know where my mother is? Your mother has gone out. How's the audio? It looks like the game might be a little too quiet. Huh? She mentioned that she would not be coming back for some time. What? She was wrong. She won't be coming back at all. So be quiet. All right, I'm going to turn the game up. You are all alone in this world now, little girl. <laughs> My sweet Alyssa. I've been waiting so long for this moment. Get away from me! <laughs> I love how British she is. Ooh, yeah, no more point and click, baby. We're moving with the control stick now. All right. It's the chair that strange gentleman was sitting in. Now I get to do my British accent whenever I'm reading stuff this game, and my British accent is impeccable. The clock keeps perfect time. The red, the light from the fire casts a reddish glow. All right, what else can I do? Oh, oh, map. We got a map. Oh, we got a timer. This game, some sort of time trial. Perfect accent. My British friend would be proud. Ew, you're friends with the British person? I'm just kidding. Don't cancel me. Oh, good, the crawl button. More games need a crawl button. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, that's awesome. Hmm, I see there's a thing over here. Strange pattern adorns the jar. It is brimming with fresh water. Uh, it's all glowy. You notice that part? Maybe I heal there or something? Diary lies open with an incomplete entry. You could save game data. Okay. File one, duh. Hmm. with art and antiques. Grandfather used to collect that kind of thing. Alright, so my family is loaded because we live in a mansion. Grandfather's room. He's not here now. It's been three years since he left. When is he coming back? And they tried to send me to boarding school without visiting home for six years. All guest rooms from this point forth. Everyone's out. Can I walk? Ah! Hold down square to walk. So I got a walk button and a crawl button. Very good. All sorts of movement options. Um, was this the room? 
Nothing of interest here. There's. So this game does have that weird thing where um, they're preset camera angles, but it's not. Oh, Alyssa. Wait, Alyssa, that was a girl's name in the last game. Is that my name again? My name Alyssa? Huh. Where uh, preset camera angles, but it's not, it's not, uh, what do they call it? Tank controls? Like you just go whatever direction you push it. It does that weird thing where when the camera angle changes, she kind of wilds out in what direction she's going. Locked and will not open. Lavender water. The TV doesn't work. Maybe it's not plugged in properly. If I'm visiting home, the first thing I'm doing is figuring out why the TV's not working. Horn book stand neatly in line. A speck of dust. Mum must have cleaned for me. door uh. the panic meter interesting whenever Alyssa's feeling physically or emotionally threatened the panic meter rises when the panic meter reaches max Alyssa falls into a state of panic while in a state of panic, Alyssa's movements are restricted, and if attacked while in a state of panic, she will die. The panic meter reading will go down slowly if Alyssa relaxes in a safe place. Always keep an eye on the panic meter and try to minimize stress whenever possible. Okay. Loose sigil preventing entry. Wait, this room is also labeled Alyssa? Oh, there's two entries, entrances to my room. That's nice. My room, nothing's changed. Hey, how rich you gotta be to have two doors into your bedroom and your own fireplace? Holy cow. Ah, good thing we have a crawl button. We can make it through here. Oh, this is where we keep our evil blood-sobbing altar. I forgot. Oh. What have we here? That looks like a bottle and a letter down there. Sacred bottle. Nancy's letter. Oh, is that me, Mum? Dearest Alyssa, I wanted nothing more than for you to live peacefully, but if you're reading this now, you must have come back to the house. For your protection, I'm giving you some advice, as well as instructions on how to use this bottle of holy water. Holy water uses. One, exorcism. If ever you are threatened, sprinkle some holy water on your assailant. It will cause them to halt temporarily. Destroying sigils. To break the seals and prevent access to certain places, sprinkle holy water on them. Replenishing holy water. Always remember that the holy water you have is not in limitless supply. You can refill your bottle from either sacred jars or lion drinking fountains. 
Sentimental items and spirits. A person who has died of unnatural causes has unfinished business in the living world. In order to protect yourself, you must work to heal their wounds. To do so, you must find their sentimental item. Lastly, this is all my fault, but I will do my best to protect you. Please remember that I love you more than anything else in the world, and I always will. Mum. Oh, it's me, Mum. It's the patron saint of the Hamilton House. What is it doing here, though? Hamilton House. Hamilton. Weren't you... Wasn't I a Hamilton... Jessica? Was it Jessica Hamilton? Wasn't I Hamilton in the first two games? Jennifer. Wasn't I Jennifer Hamilton? Jennifer didn't get his crawl button. I don't know if I'm supposed to be the same family again or if it's a totally new continuity or what. It's locked. The lodgers won't be coming back for a while. So, use our holy water? How do I use it? Lavender water. Didn't I get a bottle of holy water? Oh, it was, maybe it was an empty bottle. Maybe I have to go fill it up. Probably. Probably. We know where that is. Let's finish exploring the rest of the top floor first. Uh, Philip? Nothing of interest here. Who's Philip? All right, this should refill my holy water. Jar brimming with clean water. You can refill holy water here. Fill holy water bottle. Yeah. All right. So smart. Figured this mystery out already. That was a real tough one too. Where's my whole dang holy water? Is it under key items? Must be. There's got to be a faster way to use select button weapons. No. How do I actually use this? She said to use the holy water on sigils on doors that I can't open. I don't know how to do that. Oh, wrong. That's certainly not that button. Not the crawl. Oh! Oh! Okay. Nice. So it's like a weapon almost. Place is immaculately clean. Oh, restroom. Someone's behind the door. The door has been boarded up. I can't remember this door ever having been opened. Nancy. I mean, Mum. The three way mirror has been folded up. Mum's bed. I have a better room than mom. What's up with that? Who's in that portrait? It's been there forever. I came back home. I know you told me not to, but I couldn't help it. 
I'm so worried about you. Where are you, Mum? Maybe she's in this book. Wow, she really hates the piano. Oh? Okie doke. Door sealed shut. I guess we're here now. Oh, that's right. I forgot this game had like a time travel thing. I do remember that now that I'm seeing this. <laughs> the bombing of London? I suppose. That's kind of cool that song is still playing. The boat open. TARDIS. Something's holding the door closed. You okay? The doctor. The ring, give me back my ring. The explosion, that explosion, he looks as though he was burnt by something. An empty ring box, did someone steal the ring from him? Oh, gee, ah! So I have to find the ring for that spooky ghost? I found it. Man, I'm good. Spiritual healing. When you find a sentimental item that belongs to a person who died of unnatural causes, return it to its rightful owner. If it is a ring, put it in its case. If it is a half-heart pendant, put it together with the other half. By returning these sentimental items, spirits are healed, and Elisa may obtain another item or valuable information in return. Okay. Alright, you want your ring back, buddy? Um, all right. There you go. Sigil stone. What the heck's a sigil stone? 
We'll take an attack on your behalf just once. Oh, okay. Not too shabby. You fell in shape like a lion. You can save game data and refill your holy water bottle. Nice. building. I can hear a piano. Is it coming from that hall over there? That is a loud piano. Um, I mean, clearly I'm supposed to use my holy water here, but I haven't searched everywhere. I think I should go back and make sure I search everywhere first. Make sure we didn't miss anything before we head for that building. Refill our holy water, too. Alright, there were some stairs down over here. I never went down. Is it here? Nothing? Actually, that might have been it. <laughs> Wait, I never went down these stairs. What is with these stairs? They don't go anywhere. They just immediately go back up. What kind of design is that? Christmas Eve, 1942. 15th Annual Piano Concourse. 1942, where on earth am I? We went back in time. ghost gold fountain pen that's probably what that ghost is looking for I lost my favorite pen it's covered in bloodstains a victim's belongings the entry begins my darling must be addressed to her fiance yeah she needs her gold pen that she writes in her diary with or whatever Visibility band? Well, that sounds useful. I just got the one ring. Rings worn for temporary invisibility. How temporary are we talking? Hmm. I'll save that. One ring to rule nothing. Yeah. Taylor. Let's go. Come in. Somebody's been rummaging around the counter. Lavender water, which I'm still not not clear on what that does. Does it? Did this tell me? Cordially distilled from purple. Oh, alleviates panic. Okay, got it. Got it. Got it. I'm not getting panicked. I ain't scared. 
Gad's letter. Dear May. Oh, yeah, I click you out there. Dear May, how are you? I'm now in France in a region known as Champagne. It is a beautiful place with vineyards as far as the eye can see. When the war is over, we must come here together for a holiday. I hear they have organized for blackouts in London now. I'm sure that you're fine during the day as Jane is there, but I worry about you being alone at night. You'll be all right, won't you, darling? Keep warm with love, Daddy. Oh, a hiding spot. That's cool. That's very cool. Oh, and I can look around with the right stick. Yeah, that means we might run into a killer soon. Something we have to hide from. Look for the other side. What if there's a sound mechanic in this game? Like... They'll hear me if I walk over glass or something. I bet there is. A bunch of broken glass everywhere. Locked in, win and not open. There's blood everywhere. Ooh. Christmas tragedy, young pianist brutally murdered. Christmas day, 1942, Pall Mall. May Norton, Norton, Norton. There was another Norton, wasn't there? May Norton, age 12 was found murdered in Norton's... Oh, that's the little girl that Daddy wrote to. Murdered in Norton's, the tailor. She was discovered by Norton family nanny Jane Stride, who returned home to find the victim unconscious, bleeding from the head. An autopsy has revealed that it was an instantaneous death caused by a blow to the skull with a heavy, blunt object. No suspects have been named. The victim had taken part in the 15th Annual Piano Concourse at the Victoria Hall in Kensington the previous day. A consummate pianist, Miss Norton was widely tipped for first prize, but an unfortunate error in her performance prevented her from taking the crown. May had been living at home alone since her father, William Norton, a serving officer, returned to the front in July. That's sad. Oh, he killed a little girl! Oh, that's awful. I killed her. So I suspect he may be a bad guy. Alisa. How do you know my name? Evade points and hide points. When Alyssa is fleeing from an enemy, certain predetermined areas may start to glow. These are evade points and hide points. Approach the area and press the search button to make Alyssa take evasive action or repel her attacker. Note that most evade points can only be used once. Press the search button when in front of a hide point and Alyssa can take refuge there. The camera will switch to a first person view while in hiding. Hide points can usually be used repeatedly, but if the panic meter reaches max while in hiding, Alyssa will run out from her hiding place. Always keep an eye on the panic meter when hiding. All right. Um, excuse me. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way. Leave me alone, please. Ah! I don't have time to hide. He saw me. He's fast. He faster than me. He's so fast! Yikes! Help! <laughs> I 
goes through the circles. Stay away! I'm not in this obvious hiding spot, I promise. Dang, killers are way more intimidating in this game. Like, way more. Well, until he had, had Scotty teleport him away. That was a little odd. Uh, all right. What a scumbag. That poor little girl. I want to get him for that. One of the drawers is locked. Oh, hello. Seal off with barbed wire. Can't open this without a tool. There's blood everywhere. Books on the classics. Records look old. Oh, don't make noise, Alyssa. A key. This must be the owner of the house. Hmm, there's a key next to it. Red drawer key. I wonder if that goes to the red drawer downstairs. Well, good start to this game. So far, I got high hopes for this one. What do we got? What do we got? May's room key. Or May. I assume that's this door up here, the one that she came out of for getting her brains bashed in. Yeah. Oh my goodness. This game is brutal, dude. It's blood. There's a diary. May's diary. 5 December. Today, I darned daddy's socks and sewed a button on his shirt. He calls himself a tailor, but he can't even mend his own clothes. Please, daddy, I'm not your wife. 15 December, so 10 days later. Only a few more days until the concourse, and I still can't play it perfectly. What am I to do? I know daddy's wishing me well from far away, so I must try my very best. Don't worry, daddy, I'll make you proud. Invitation. Oh no. Alisa. I think he might suspect I'm in this room. I can't be sure. Escape route's been blocked. What do I do? I don't know. Try this glowing thing. Or we're gonna bash him with a chair. Highly effective against zombies. Alisa. Well, that, well, that, wow, Alyssa. Not too shabby. Run before he gets up. I have a feeling he's not going to stay down. Wait, is he actually staying down? He is staying down. Uh, let's look at this invitation I found.
Invitation to concert hall. Used for piano concourse. I mean, that's what I assumed it was. Okay. So maybe we needed this before it would let us go in the concert hall? I wonder if I should go refill my holy water and save. Probably not a bad idea. I don't think it's very far. Oh no! Alyssa! No, you got the wrong person. I'm not Alyssa. Ah! He's so fast! Leave me be, crazy hammer man. Ah. Stop it. Can I refill while he chases me? Oh man, what's up Satan Greymon? Yes, this guy uh, is very, can I? Oh, nice. You can holy water him. <laughs> See a sucker? Oh, it doesn't stop for very long. Oh man, I'm so used from the other Clock Tower games to the bad guys being so slow. He's super fast. Oh! Stuck! I know where to lose him, maybe. Oh, does he not follow me in here? Does he not follow through loading zone? Oh, too slow, idiot. <laughs> Teleport away. Hey. He didn't want to give up this time. I think that was his teleportation sound. Yeah. Yeah, much more intimidating uh, killers. All right. Where, oh, I never tried to cross this bridge over here. Where does this go? There's something down there. City Hall. Let's go get whatever that was next to the bridge. So, uh, Satan Greymon, you a fan of this game, or are you just kind of browsing around and wandered into this stream? More lavender water. Okay. Safe point. Should have just come over here. Oh no, come on, man. I was just exploring for a second. Man, they show up a lot more in this one too. We changed his mind.
There's a fountain. A leaflet, Christmas Eve, 42, 50 the annual piano concourse. Okay. Yep, I got my invitation. We in. this game have multiple endings like the other ones or is it more just straightforward I didn't see anything about multiple endings basically I'm wondering if I need to keep multiple saves in case I soft lock myself out of the best ending or something watching the piano recitals. Oh, geez. Leave me alone. Okay, let's go backstage. What's back there? <laughs> Miss me. Oh, there's nothing back here. Oh, no. Pull the lever. Ooh. Horse has been crushed. What a horrible death. He's holding something. A note is scribbled on a tiny scrap of paper. Safe combination equals bad. 1014 equals babe, 3403 equals dead. So what, 103? That's the safe combination? 103? Where'd he go? Oh, he's looking for me. He lost me. What an idiot. Uh, I always expect loading screens and forget I'm supposed to actually walk through the door myself. I'm just going to keep doing what I'm supposed to do while he's chasing me. Go 
do we got? What do we got? Master key. I like the sound of that. Lavender water. But how do I ditch this fool? I don't see a hiding place. Oh, can you just run away? Must require a special key. Use the master key. Oh, jeez! Ah! Oh, great. We're panicked. Oh, don't go that way. Alyssa, please move. Please don't stand still. Ah. He did a little dance when he hit me. That's so disrespectful. Alyssa, I swear, I don't think it's a good idea to stop and stand still. Oh, lockers. I'm not gonna have time to hide in the man eye. Owie. Ah! Oh wait, I have stuff that makes my panic go away, don't I? I feel fine now. No biggie. Hey, come here, buddy. Hey, like that. Oh man, that really does not stall in for very long. How am I supposed to get all the way to that locker before he comes in? Oh, he stops and kicks it for a bit. I think he may have seen me go. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> get out. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm just gonna go through here real quick. Wait, last time he stopped chasing me, he got sneaky and whacked me when I went through that door. Is that what he's doing again? I need to find a hiding place. Oh, wait, we can crawl button. So you can actually probably try to hide in a room without a hiding spot in this game, can't you? That must be what the crawl button's for, to try to be sneaky. Ooh, I need to use that some. Okay, move slow. Don't be noisy. Where am I? Check that other door. Locked on the other side. All right, all right. Top limits. We can't go in an area that's off limits. I wonder who invented this instrument anyway. Oh, this is now is not the time. Very nice dresses, better not touch those. I might get them dirty. Lovely piano. Ooh, hello. Matches. We can go set things on fire now. Uh oh, that's not good. What's happening? This guy again. Hey, yo! I do not approve. Oh, what do I got? Not if his violin case has anything to say about it. Nice. Good job, Alyssa. That was a nice little scream, too. Oh, 
Well, I can't get out that way anymore. Well, where do you want to go then, Alyssa? Kind of blocked off from going anywhere. Hmm, but was there a door here? Um... Where am I supposed to go? Oh, crawl. Duh, crawl button. Go through here. Nice. Invisibility. Oh, I forgot I had invisibility bands. I can make myself invisible if I need to. Probably helpful. Dang it. Hmm. All I got up here is matches, I think. Ah, this was the room with the locker. Did I ever search these? Nothing here. Really nothing here. Sneaky. I like the way... I like the way the hiding works. That's fun. Nope, can't get through. What did I expect? I don't have any money. Why do I want to use matches? Oh uh, no! I'm not Alyssa, I swear. You're Alyssa. You can't get in there fast enough. He gets through that door too quick. I guess I have to do it through this door. I gotta lose him, run back through this door. It's the last of my holy water. He's right behind me so fast. All right, I think we made it. Alyssa, where are you? I was gonna be like, I'm not Alyssa. I'm Alyssa Clock Tower Ghost Heads Japanese name. Then I realized I didn't Alyssa, remember it. Uh, um, Maxwell, right? Or wait, well, your real dad was Maxwell. I mean, I literally just beat that <laughs> like an hour ago. Oh, that game sucked so bad. I really hated that game. Okay, we're good. Friggin' ghost head, never again. Never again. Hale? Hale, right? Your fake dad was named Hale. Alan Hale. You, was you like the Japanese title? I So I just played the American version. I don't know if you watched any of that. Her Japanese name was you? Okay. Oh, hated it. Hated that game. Ooh, have I been out here? So far, this game is pretty fun. Way, way better game. Strange here. This game isn't done yet? What do you mean? Like, it's gonna get bad? It's a bad game? Is that what you're saying? 
No, Frenchy, I just started this game. Yeah, this is this is Clock Tower 3. We beat Ghost Head. We're done with that piece of crap. This is a good game. We're enjoying this one. Her birth name was Lynn Maxwell in the English, Rin Saito in Japanese. Ah. Oh, yeah, I'm so glad to be done with that game, Frenchy. Uh, well, I'm glad he didn't follow me up here, but I can't... I have to go raise that thing again. That's annoying. And, Frenchy, it's a shame you missed out. Nothing was explained and nothing made sense when we beat it. The story in that game is so bad. It is such a piece of trash. They didn't explain anything. They don't even explain why they're zombies. You, I mean, you missed a lot of stuff. They like made up twists to be like, look how smart we are, we have twists in our game. But the twists don't explain anything, it's stupid. Uh, really no, do you know Dangan Rampa? Heck yes I do, big fan. I've only beaten the first Dangan Rampa. I own all of them, uh, but I kind of burned out on it right when I started the second, because I tried to start it right after I beat the first. Uh, so I will go back and finish them sometime. But the first was an excellent game. I was a, I liked it a lot. <laughs> he doesn't know I'm here. We use the sneaky crawl button until he goes away. Awesome. Jill, Toko's other personality, is called Seo Sho in Japanese, which is Bates' name in Japanese. Interesting. Are you... You're very knowledgeable on that game, Satan Greymon. Do you like that game? I find that hard to understand how that's possible. And I have, I have uh, a very high tolerance for bad games. And I consider that one of the worst games I've ever played. And I really enjoyed the first two Clock Tower games. I've been playing through the whole franchise in order. No, I just know a lot about it. I mean, I admit I'm, I'm interested in trying to learn a bit about the development because when a game is like that much of a travesty, like you, you have to be curious what went on in development. I'd watch a documentary about the making of that game for sure. Ooh, yes, use the matches. I don't know why, but do it. All right. Oh my. Light from the light. Am I supposed to? Oh, this seems dangerous. Alyssa, I don't know about this. Alyssa. So far, my favorite clock tower remains clock tower two for the Japanese title slash clock tower PlayStation one for the American title. Uh, I really, really liked that game a lot. We got some pliers. But this game's fun so far, although I'm at the very beginning. It's very fun so far. It's like fast. This game is super fast paced compared to all the other clock towers. It's a little butterfly. Actually, that's a big butterfly. Butterfly, you're not helping. Um, what the heck am I supposed to do, Butterfly? Save me! Too risky to cross now. What? Ah! I do like his little dance. He gets really happy when he hits me. 
kind of adorable. I think it's a moth? Eh, probably. It reminds me of the dance Scissor Man would do when he when he would hit you. There was nothing funny like that in uh, Ghost Head. Like we play, he does very politely wait for you open the door. I'm gonna go back to my hiding spot behind the curtain. That seems to be very effective. Alicia, where are you? What are you doing, moths? Hey, are you bad? Boss, I thought you were good. Stop! Alicia, where are you? You're gonna give me away! Monster jerks! Yeah, it works. Go away, Moth. Okay, what the heck? Go away, this is really annoying. <laughs> Uh, let me see. I just got pliers. Where do I want to use pliers at? Oh, man. Oh. So freaking fast. I don't have time to get to the locker. He, it does feel like he's Sonic compared to the other games. Oh, he lost me. Roll button. He doesn't know we're here. He doesn't know. We're going sneak mode. Alyssa, stop! Oh, we... I think he sees me. Do you see me? Yes, he sees me. Freaking Flash trying to kill me right now. Wasn't there a door covered in barbed wire somewhere? Where was that? Was that in that first house? That pliers would make sense there. Break the barbed wire. So, uh... Satan Greymon, what's your favorite Clock Tower game? It's assuming you've played them all. And I'd count Haunting Grounds as one as well. I intend to play that one as well. She's playing the piano so earnestly. What's she trying to express? Probably that she's sad that she screwed up in the piano recital and then got murdered. I have played none of them. Plot twist. That is a plot twist. That's a better plot twist than anything in... Ghost Head. All right, let's save. I just know like a lot of random things about horror games. Hey, no worries. They are interesting, that's for sure. I've uh, I have a, I've played a lot of classic horror games, but this is my first time playing through the Clock Tower series, and I'm having a great time with it. I forgot what was in here. What's in this room? Oh, this is just this room again. All right, I think I need to go find... Where did I use... No, again? All right, maybe the killers are a little too relentless in this game. Like, they're always chasing you. Oh.
Leave me alone. Where do I use the pliers? Wasn't there a door out here? No. It's not a door, apparently. I mean, I like that he's like calling my name and he has like a creepy voice. He's a cool killer. But I wish he would freaking calm down. Oh, great. Butterflies. Stay away, butterfly. Okay, was it in here? Was one of the rooms in this building covered in uh, barbed wire? Oh, he came in so fast. I wanted to go to my favorite hiding spot. Go. Go. We'll do our little loop. We'll do a loop and then hide there. Was the barbed wire room not here? I sure thought it was here. Maybe it's in through that door. We gotta lose this guy first. Do a loop-de-loop -loop and pull and shoot that looking cool. Hey buddy, take that. Now you stay here. Let me do my thing. Oh man, I thought he saw me. That was close. Get wrecked. Stupid hammer jerk. All right. I did not remember right. I don't think it's in this building. After all, I don't know where to use the pliers. I, I, I know somewhere I saw a door tied closed with barbed wire and I just can't remember where it was. Now he hasn't attacked me in like a minute and a half. He's gonna attack me again. One more area I can check. Maybe it is here back here is it oh it is back oh that's not barbed wire yes that is it i was right yes hooray wooden box let's open it tell you something important daddy's going off to war Ooh. I hate the thought of leaving you here all alone I feel dreadful I'll be all right but what about you you'll miss me and be sad when you're in war won't you yes yes I will you're the most precious thing to me in the whole world but don't worry daddy don't forget the piano concourse is on Christmas Eve the winner will have their performance aired on the radio. 
I'll practice really hard and win the contest so that you can hear me when you're out in the war. That would be wonderful. The competition will be stiff, but if you go to your lessons and practice properly, I'm sure you can do it. I'll practice every day. I've already chosen the piece I'm going to play. Listen. Yeah, this is so sad. This is a really sad game. This poor you girl. You told me this watch was a present from Mummy before you got married, remember? I'll play this tune on Christmas Eve so you can think of Mummy and me. Then it'll be like we're all together again. Oh, and her dad had a horrible death on the battlefield, too, to make it even worse. Uh. Okay, watch. More inside. Hammer Killer Hanged. 10 September 1941. Robert Morris, 32, the man known as the Hammer Killer, has been hanged. Rumors regarding Morris's death are widespread. One witness reported he was hanging for a very long time, pulling on the straps and making unearthly noises, and blood was oozing through the black cap. The stench was terrible. Some witnesses fainted and were carried out. I'm fairly certain that we're in 1942 right now. So he was supposed to have been hanged before this little girl was murdered. Morris's first victim was Tony Flanagan, 35, a fellow employee at the Banbury Stonecutting Factory. On 6 June 1940, Morris suddenly struck Flanagan on the head with a hammer, killing him instantly. All five workers present were killed in the same manner. Morris disappeared thereafter. A string of similar crimes occurred until the time of Morris's arrest on 6th March in Arlington, Hampshire. Morris's victims numbered 12, and no clear motive has been determined. Specialists continue to be baffled by the seemingly abrupt change in his behavior, as well as the extreme violence of his crimes. Hmm. Maybe I can save May if I get her father's pocket watch to her. I have to take the pocket watch to the concert hall. Yes. Poor little girl. That's too sad. Well, what's this? Repellent Arrow. Not only do I have to get back to her, I bet he is going to attack me soon. Let's see if I can be more clever than him. Hide first. Now that I have to get back to her, I'm sure I have to get back to her without him be chasing me, because she seems to disappear if she sees him. She gets scared. There's no way I make it back without getting attacked. Nope, I didn't mean to do that. refill and save. This game is so wildly different from the previous 3 o'clock tower games. Mostly in a good way. I would consider the changes to this game so far to be refreshing. Here we go. Alicia. Alicia. <laughs> you figured me 
out, little girl. They thought they got rid of me that day on the gallows. But they little May was only the beginning. Why? Why did you kill her? <laughs> You're next. <laughs> Boss battle! I had forgotten this game has, like, actual boss fights. Alright, move the analog stick, duck with O, shoot arrows with triangle, charge arrow by holding it, super attack, hold down, with the enemy, transfixed, whatever that means, and R1 for a special attack. Whatever. Triangle, or hold triangle, and O to duck. In order to defeat the enemy, Alyssa must first transfix it by hitting the enemy with a charged arrow. Hold down triangle to charge. It is possible to fix them to the spot. Several strategically placed chains will transfix the target. Aim so that the chains fan out from the target, who should be in the center. While the enemy is transfixed, the list is able to carry out a super attack. It is no easy task, however, to hit the target with the arrow. Watch the enemy's movements closely and wait for your chance. Duck can be used to avoid attacks by certain enemies. It may also cause them to become careless and vulnerable to attack. Press the R1 button to use special arrows, such as the repellent arrow, in or the order in which they were obtained. It's wise to save these weapons for special occasions. Okay. Well, we'll figure it out. This sounds a little bit complicated. This is weird. Bet you didn't expect this, Hammer Man. I have a magical bow and arrow. 26 victims. Wow, Sledgehammer. Sentenced to 486 years. Judgment. What in the world? How odd. Oh, I have to, like, aim. Hitting him? Oh, I wasn't charging it enough. Okay. Whoa! That hurt me from way over there? Transfix this fool. How do you avoid that? I was hitting circle, which is supposed to dodge. Didn't do anything. Ah! I think he's transfixed, maybe. Alright, and so then I had to hit him from, like, other angles? That would work? can't turn so I can't turn at all hmm kind of odd this is gonna take some getting used to okay one two 
to. right I feel like it's doing something oh super attack okay I think we got him Take that, you jerk. That's for me. This is a weird game. Clover of Love. What's that? Oh, I don't need that. Jewel shaped like a clover leaf has strange powers. Well, that doesn't really help, but okay. I'm sure I'll find out. Save now we beat that fool. Oh, so this is first stage. I wonder how many stages there are. If it's like the other games, there'll be three. A shell. I'm so sorry. Please don't cry. I understand how you feel. I never even knew my father. I lost him soon after I was born. But I love my grandfather just the way you love your father. Keep this watch as a memento of your father and continue to practice the piano as hard as you can. You know that would make him happy. together again. Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you. Thank you. 
Well, it's kind of a happy ending. Goodbye, Mr. Norton. Uh, Goodbye. we helped save the soul of that poor little girl, and we killed we killed the sledgehammer killer. Duh, Frenchie, what do you think happened? Oh, we're back in my own time. This game is weird, but pretty cool. That was all fun. What was that? Have I been dreaming? Save game data. That is probably a perfect spot to end the stream for the day. I will be picking this back up tomorrow. Hopefully I'll see you again. Hey, thanks, Satan Greymon. I appreciate it. Hey, and thanks so much for the follow. Yeah, I'll be continuing this tomorrow. Uh, 3 o'clock Pacific time is when I stream every day. So I'm actually going to pause this because I'll Dennis, pick it up right here tomorrow. Hey, here? stop doing things. Oh, be paused. Get out of here. Yeah, Frenchie, good to see you. Satan Greymon, nice to meet you. I hope to see you again. And yeah, I'm going to call it here. Thanks so much for hanging out and have a great day. And I hope you enjoyed your day off, Frenchie. Are you back at work tomorrow, Frenchie, or do you have another day off? Oh, uh, well, I, you don't even need to say more. I can figure out where it's going from, unfortunately. Sorry to hear it, but I hope you enjoyed your day off. <laughs> All right. Have a good one. I will see you tomorrow.